Peter Doyle, it is now the post Maladin era. You have a new rider. Uh, yeah, it appears that way. Yeah, um, with Blake this year, the team's obviously, uh, it's, it's downsized a little bit from last year. Uh, we're back to a two-rider a structure, and, uh, and uh, yeah, Matt will be, uh, he'll be, he'll be uh, missed in this team. Obviously, uh, so much success over the years, and we've got, uh, there's two guys now that have never won a superbike race in the U.S., so we're, uh, there's a, we've got a job ahead of us. Yeah, but that's got to be refreshing. Oh, it's good in a sense. I mean, if we, uh, I'm sure everyone will be very happy if these uh, if we can get these guys up to win a race. We were just talking before off camera about rear brakes, yep. and it was very interesting about Blake doesn't touch it, Matt uses it a little bit, and Tommy uses it all the time. Yeah, it's um, looking at the data from yesterday. Yeah, Blake does not touch the rear brake at all. Um, Matt, you know, Matt uses it. He's uh, one of the older guys, so he uses it. Uh, a little bit on corner exit, sometimes on entry, but uh, but yeah, Tommy he 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 burns up every rear brake we put on the bike. So um, basically, the uh, we're not sort of too fussed about what rear brake we have on the bike, even with Matt and and obviously now with Blake. Whatever Tommy runs, if it's bulletproof, it's going to be bulletproof. So uh, we use it. If Tommy doesn't break it, nothing can break it. Yeah, I think uh, it must be the dirt trackers. I, I hear Nicky's the same. So. Uh, can you tell, does he use it on both rights and left-hand turns or just mostly on left-hand turns? Everywhere. <laughs> In, out, he's, he's, it's like his foot's almost always on it. But, uh, but he, uh, obviously he, he's controlling it. I mean, he's not, if he's just locking up the rear wheel, so uh, he, uh, just the way he rides. There's, there's been guys around like that over the years. As you said, it's the old, as we discussed, the old-fashioned spin control. Yeah. <laughs> So in that instance, then, I guess Blake is relying on the engine braking more and Tommy is assisting the engine braking if he's going into the corner with it. Oh, for sure. Um, I think, you know, I don't say it's a, it's a thing with the young guys. You know, maybe Blake wasn't a, um, a big-time dirt tracker like Tommy, which is probably where they learn it all. Um, but you know, we've had guys over these Aaron Slight, for example, we worked with for years, and you know, he never touched the rear brake. Um, they rely on more on, on engine setting or you know their riding style to uh, to get the job done without the rear brake. I think I mean I think ultimately if you can use the rear brake in some capacity, you should be able to. It should be an advantage to you. God gave you rear brake for a reason. <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, thanks, Peter. Appreciate it. No worries. So thanks.